A new piece of art is turning heads in a section of South Etobicoke. The presence of a pistol in a large mural on the side of a business. CTV's Beth McDonnell reports. It's a new mural brushing up controversy in New Toronto at the corner of Lakeshore and Fifth. In the middle, a Punjabi rapper who went by Sidhu Musewala holding a gun. He was a rising artist in the South Asian music scene and lived for a time in Brampton before being fatally shot last year in India. It promotes violence. Biggie was shot down, Tupac was shot down, the other guy was shot down, the other two were in gangster movies. This woman has lived near the intersection for 17 years. Over the past several days, many have been questioning the mural and commenting online. To compare to the other one, it's really upsetting. Uh, considering that it doesn't represent our neighborhood at all. This was the old mural, an old train stopping at Islington Station. But there is also support for the new mural. Good, it's a reputation of bygones, people that passed away. I don't think it's negative. I think it's positive. It's art uh, and it's cool. She says it's cool. Um, I mean, I know who everyone is, so it resonates with me. And A member of the Long Branch Neighborhood Association, the area just west of New Toronto, tells CTV News the previous mural had been on this wall for decades. The member says the association is concerned about a lack of community consultation on the project. So what we're looking at here is a slight play on The Last Supper. The artist says he's known to clients as David G. He says he was hired by a friend to paint the mural attached to the Punjabi bakery, and the owner wanted Sidhu Musewala on it. G says because there was more space, he decided to include other figures from pop culture. Negative stuff, which everyone talks about, is just a small minority. They're very vocal, they're very rude. It's a specific demographic. I don't want to get into it because I don't want to focus on the negative. They will be the way they will indefinitely. That's probably their demeanor. But the positive people have come up, taken pictures, bought me lunch. City of Toronto says it received two complaints and is investigating. G says the mural doesn't depict gun violence and says he hopes his employers are happy with his work. Beth McDonnell, CTV News.